Hello, I'm Dr. Maurizio Giacomello and I am a visiting professor at the University of Milan Bicocca in uh, Italy, where I teach uh, several uh, topics, above all cranial anatomy, uh, functional anatomy of the stomatognetic apparatus at the first year of uh, uh, the dental school of the same university, and at the fifth year I usually teach uh, gnatology. I would like to invite you to follow our course of gnatology from occlusal forces to dysfunction on the platform OHIS. I recommend this course for all people involved in oral rehabilitation, above all dentists for sure, but also maxillofacial surgeons, osteopaths, physiotherapists, and other therapists that are involved with this part of the body. In particular, in dentistry, this course is dedicated to the orthodontist, the prosthodontist, and the general dentist that are usually involved with the occlusal pain, plane reconstruction, even if only with fillings, because uh, when we modify the occlusal plane, we create a new situation, a new condition that involves the uh, natological rules. The course is composed by two parts. The first one in which I approach the functional anatomy of the stomatognetic apparatus, that is in which it's described how normally the several structures work, work and the second one in which the problem of the biomechanical dysfunction is, uh, of the system is approached. So we have two different parts, from function to dysfunction. Just knowing the function, we can understand how and why the system becomes dysfunctional. So in the, in the first part, um, we are going to approach the basic concept of the occlusion from the centric occlusion to the centric relation, while in the second, the functional anatomy of the, TM, of the TMJ and the muscle without a simple description of the structures, but emphasizing the concept that have an importance to understand the clinical aspect of the dysfunction. So, just uh, knowing how the muscles and the TMJ work in a good way, just uh, knowing that we can change the dysfunctional patient and the dysfunctional system. The third part is a bit difficult. The third webinar is a bit difficult because I approach the analysis uh, of the occlusal forces in their dissipation on the skull, both in static and in dynamic conditions. It's based on physics concept and can help the dentist to avoid the therapeutic problems and above all to understand any perception of discomfort reported by the patients. The fourth and the five parts are dedicated to the biomechanical dysfunction highlighting the causes and the therapeutic possibilities. You will also learn how to solve in a simple way a mandible clicking, expression of a biomechanical alteration of the movements of the mandible, starting from the analysis of the cranio-mandibular relationship. Just changing the cranio-mandibular relationship, we can change the uh, function of the mouth. We can change the dysfunctional aspect of the uh, improving the health of the patient. You will also learn about the techniques and protocols of joint infiltration with PRP to solve osteoarthritis and some other painful pathologies, chronic pathologies of the TMJ. After completing the course, you will be able to project an oral rehabilitation, both uh, prosthetical or orthodontical, uh, following the concept of a good function of the stomatognetic apparatus. Thank you.